morning, I guess afternoon, since it's almost one here. Ah! I'm on my way to my elementary school. I'm meeting up with my mentor teacher. Ooh, sorry, I was blocking the camera. I am meeting up with my mentor and we're gonna get this week planned out, which will be great. Okay, so like I've talked about, I'm doing the Advocate Advocare 2040 challenge. It's not necessarily because I think it'll be a quick fix. Actually, it's really not at all because I think it'll be a quick fix and make me lose weight. I really want to do it to be able to give everyone like an honest review of it and to document what it's like when you are trying to lose weight because how many of you felt really desperate and you see ads for these and you're just like you know what I'm just gonna do that and I'll lose all this weight and keep it off and it'll be so great because I mean I feel like if there was a magic pill and it would make me fit and healthy I would be so tempted to take it and that's really what this is is I've done my research on Advocare and Beachbody and whatever other crap there is out there and I chose this one because I had talked to somebody about it and it had a lot of there was a lot of people curious about it and I was curious about it because who wouldn't be it's like 24 days you can cleanse your body and do all this stuff I don't think cleanses work I'm honestly doing this because I'm curious and kind of as an experiment to see how my body's gonna react to it, how I feel. I can tell you yesterday going to the bathroom, I felt like everything was leaving my body. <laughs> but I mean, that's because the fiber drink is fiber. Like there's so much in it. It's grainy and it gelatinous and it's really not all that fun. And I went on to my fitness pal yesterday just in the community and uh, I asked if anyone else had done it and if they had any tips to make getting the fiber drink down easier. I had, I think, six people comment on it. Four of them were just rude. Like, they were mean. And they were saying, don't waste your money, you might as well just throw it away and all this stuff. And I'm like, you know what? You don't know my life. And it was just almost hurtful. Like they were really rude and mean about it. And then two people comment commented saying that they did it and this is what they did to make it easier. And so I tried one of them this morning because she said to use a straw and just put it as far back in your mouth as you can. And so you don't taste it. And it worked a lot better. Yesterday, I plugged my nose and just tried to chug. And I'd get like two gulps down and then be like, nope. So I had food ready and I had some of the spark ready so I could dilute the taste in my mouth and keep it down. And I did. Today's was a lot easier. So I'm definitely going to be using the straw for the rest of them. And I thought that I was going to need to take one every day for the first like two weeks and I don't, I have three left. So you take six of them total and then you go on to, I, there's also little pills in the box. So I'm assuming after I finish these six, then I'll go on to taking those instead. I need to finish reading up on this because I am doing something wrong. <laughs> So, it'll all be good. I'll, you guys will be there with me the whole time. So, you'll know what I know. And I'm not going to filter anything. Like, I am so sick of having such biased opinions on everything. So, this is an unedited, unbiased opinion of the thing. I will say that my body feels... I don't know, almost like the only way I can really describe it is clean. Like I don't feel heavy and gross like I sometimes do, 
because I haven't had the best diet in my life. So, I mean, there's that. Um, I really like the app that comes with it. Um, I like that it's really not restrictive in the diet. The meal replacement shake doesn't taste great. If I could mix it with milk, I think it would be a lot better, but you do need to cut back on dairy a little bit. And let's see, that's, that's about it so far. Maybe if I did this, I would have preferred like a mix of flavors that I could try because I just got the chocolate and I mean it's not bad it tastes like a protein shake though and protein shakes I don't think taste all that great so I have it frozen at home and I'll eat it pretend it's ice cream because <laughs> that makes things easier but do not think I'm doing this because I think I'm going to lose a bunch of weight really quickly and it'll be super effective and all this stuff it's expensive a 24 day challenge was like 180 dollars and i mean i don't know if i would have actually done this if i hadn't started making this vlog so there's that as well but i don't regret buying it and trying it just because I'll be able to have these videos out there for people to go back and reference. So, there's that. Anyway, let's go to a little lighter note. I'm sorry about yesterday's video. I feel like I probably cut you off. Um, we... Okay, so after I got to the gym, I did my Pilates class and the lady asked if anyone had anything they wanted to do and we were waiting for some people to get back and then she's like have you done this before and I was like yeah this is my second class I haven't been here in a couple weeks but last time I was here we did the butt blaster or whatever and it hurts my hips and my butts they hurt Ugh. and after I pulled up I don't know if you guys saw in the video yesterday there was a fire truck pulling out in my rearview mirror and they came to the gym! Fire truck and an ambulance. Apparently a piece of equipment had fallen and landed on some guy's head. Ah! And then, so they brought the stretcher in and all this stuff and then they left and we all just assumed they took him with him. And then five minutes later, he walks out to his car and drives away. And I was like, I really hope he's okay because if he's not, and he might be seeing the ambulance a second time and I just really hope that wasn't the case so well I did Pilates and it hurt me in such a good way the burn the burn was real and after that I did a 10 mile bike ride so that was good I forgot my headphones so I went to the cardio theater and the bikes are a little different so it was just, I don't know it feels a little awkward and I tried one of the cycling bikes and it was horrible like you don't move your feet very far and I tried stopping I was like oh my god it just like yanked me around and I thought I was gonna break an ankle so I don't think cycling is gonna be for me and that's okay uh, and so after that I went home we got showered and changed and as you can see I have remnants of yesterday's makeup on my face and we went out to dinner to old chicago for my friend's birthday she wanted to dress up so did the whole whole face of makeup and um i even wore a dress and tights and wedge heeled boots and that jazz and so we went out there was five of us had a blast we um all just split an appetizer like the largest appetizer and then we all just got desserts and had alcoholic beverage for the first time in a very long time and I was surprised I was able to drink it because I can taste the alcohol and everything but it was good after that we went back to one of the other girls house and played with our kitten and watched Hansel and Gretel's um, Sorry, those people on bikes trying to cross the street. But we watched Hansel and Gretel Witch Hunters. 
and it was wonderful because I it's so bad it's good and it has oh is it going okay sorry it has um what's his bucket Jeremy Renner in it and I really like him and it's just, it's so bad, it's good. That's really how that goes. So, I'm at the school. I'll talk to you guys later. Oh, I can feel, I don't know if you heard that, but that was pretty, whew, I'm broken. So, see if I can get this makeup cleaned up before I go inside and see my mentor teacher. But, yep, I have a lot to do today. I have a lot to do today, so. If we get done by two, I'm debating about going to the other Pilates class, so I wore my gym clothes and we'll see. Either way, today's running, so that'll be good. I really am starting to enjoy running days, which I never thought I would do. So. Okay, talk to you guys later. Okay, bye. Okay didn't make it to the gym because oh, we ended up spending almost four hours at the school and then my friend came over and we got our plans and worksheets and everything made for the week so it is what it is and that's okay so no 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 I'll talk to you guys tomorrow and yeah, I don't know. Have a good night. Tomorrow's Monday. Be prepared. Okay, bye.